What is going on everybody? Welcome to the seventh Monte Carlo and Python tutorial video. In the last video we kind of saw some of the statistics and visually saw how well the whole double or better guy does. The next question that is pretty much inevitable is how does this guy fare compared to our other better, the simple better? Where is he? I don't think we deleted him. Oh, he's down here. <laughs> anyway, so that's what we want to do in this video is kind of compare these guys and see who is the superior. So uh, with that, uh, what we're going to want to do is kind of make some edits here so they both are plotted up. And so the first thing that we want to do is we'll just delete this for now and we'll just comment this stuff out because <clears throat> we don't need it for now. Once you've done that, the next thing we want to do is go to our simple better and he needs a, uh, let's see, I guess for now let's just get simple better. So we have the results from before with the death rate and the survival rate. Uh, so we'll run the same sort of test and again those were given to us with, I believe we were doing a thousand wagers. Um, <clears throat> so anyway we'll just kind of play around with that and see the survival rate of our simple better. Uh, next. So what we'll do here is we will global uh, again broke count and we'll come down here and broke count plus equals one whenever he goes broke and then here uh, we just start broke count equals zero thousand this should be I honestly can't remember. I don't know if we were doing a thousand or ten thousand to get those numbers. I think it was just a thousand. <clears throat> so now, but we could just compare the ending survival rate, um, which was yeah, survival rate of seventy percent at this amount here. So a hundred wagers. So let's do that one first since we're positive on that. So hundred wager wagers, and I think we did ten thousand betters up here. Nope, we only did a thousand. Okay, so ten thousand wagers, a thousand, or a thousand, yeah, ten. <laughs> I can't even speak. A hundred wagers and a thousand samples, so a thousand betters, basically. So broke count, blah blah blah, and then down here we'll do uh, basically the same thing we did up here. So I'm just going to copy and paste this. Um, paste. Should be everything we need to do. I feel like I ran through this really quickly though, so we'll find out real quick if I did something wrong. Name error. XX is not defined. Of course it's not. Delete, delete. Matplotlib is going to be so angry at me. Oh, we left that chart up. Oh my goodness, it's going to get angry. Uh, should give me one more of those errors. Oh well. Anyway, we'll run it again. There it is. It's waiting for you. Okay, so here we can see that actually nobody died, right? The death rate is zero. Survival rate is 100. So everybody lived. Um, but as we can see, not everybody did well, but everybody lived. Some people actually uh, did make a good, healthy uh, profit. Some of these guys made it to 13,000 even. Uh, so s kind of similar profits. But as we can see long, long term, if you were going to make a lot of wagers, the doubler obviously does much better than the, this guy because this guy on a long-term scale will lose 100% as we already found out. So let's go ahead and make it a thousand wagers now and see how much that changes our death and survival rate. So now we can see that a, a couple people have died. Not many, but a few. And let's go ahead and make this a larger sample and then we'll do 10,000 here. Let's do 100,000 and we, we'll see. Um, this should make a significant difference. So while we're waiting, I guess I could probably just pause this. This might take a while. Right, well that is just taking way too long. I even lowered the number uh, to 50,000, so we'll see. Um, but anyway, <clears throat> if it pops up while I'm talking, great. If it doesn't, we'll just stop the video. So already so far we can see that at least a couple of variables that must come into play regardless of uh, what strategy you use is the wager size in terms of percent in relation to how much your starting wealth is and then also how many wagers are we doing so some of these strategies um, have basically a life expectancy long term of, of zero okay so the simple better for example he is basically 100 percent certain to lose his money long term he 
He has no option. If he plays long enough, he will lose money. Then you've got the doubler better, who conceivably, um, even on the longest scale, some of these double betters are going to make it through. I mean, on, on an infinitely long scale, I suppose they all would, in theory, lose. Um, but for the most part, he actually stands a chance of making possibly some money, but he's going to most likely go broke. So for the doubler better, he's got even another variable, which is how much, you know, right now he's doubling, but <clears throat> is there a different multiple that is better? And then also you have the question of how many wagers should he do before returning back uh, to his initial state? So if the survival rate is over 50% and you've got an over 50% chance of doubling your money, let's say, or, or just at least adding to your money, um, I suppose it would have to be doubling your money though, then it would be wise to keep playing. Uh, so say you had $10,000, you would keep playing, and, it, and if you made more than $10,000 on average, um, you would just keep doing this, and at a certain point you would start all over and say, okay, I've got $10,000 to play with again and keep doing that, stuff like that. So. The question is, does this exist? Is there a strategy that works like that? And if so, can we find it? So anyways, um, that's what we're seeking out here. Uh, still have not had this chart pop up, so I'll just stop it here. Um, you should just understand that the survival rate of the simple better short term is going to be really, really good. Long term, it will die. And then also medium term, it's just not going to make very much money. It might survive, uh, but it, the actual profits uh, will not be the same as the survivors of the doubler better. So anyways, that's going to conclude this video. As always, thanks for watching.